Hi everyone, Brian Keane here. Uh, if you're wondering why we are looking at a, a random shot of my vinyl collection and John Urban Six Cat and Mary San Giovanni's Cat Around the Christmas Tree, that's because I have uh, two surprises for you this evening. We're going to be looking at Wesley Southard's new short story collection, Resisting Madness. And oh my God, what a collection it is. I, I have to to share this with everyone. But before we do that, we're gonna talk about VHS tapes, movies on videotape, uh, something of a bygone era. Now I know that just like collecting vinyl, that collecting VHS tapes has become popular once again, uh, particularly among the millennial crowd. Uh, you know, these are artifacts that maybe your parents or your grandparents had in their home, or maybe even, you know, you grew up with them there at the tail end. Um, you know, it used to be a whole culture built around, you know, the video store and, and renting horror films. I know I'm certainly part of that culture. Uh, in the 80s when I was a teenager and, and a, a young person, you know, uh, I mean, yeah, we had chains like Blockbuster. But the, the really cool stores were the little indie mom and pop stores where you could find things like this. This is Addicted to Murder. If you are a fan of Tom Piccarelli... I, I am willing to bet you've never heard of this film. Uh, but it was, in fact, written by Tom Piccarelli and Kevin Lindenmuth. Now, Tom had his thoughts on this movie, and, and that's why he never included it in his bio. And, you know, Tom was one of my best friends. I am going to respect him, even though he's not here anymore to talk about it. Uh, I'm going to respect him in that he probably doesn't want me to talk too much about this movie. But it's a rare artifact, and, uh, you know, if you're a fan of Tom's, it's pretty cool to see. And it's on VHS tape, so, you know, I'm showing you the side of the, the box, you know. And, of course, here's the back. Now, why am I showing this to you? Well, because Wesley Southard's new collection, Resisting Madness, which is a short story collection, is designed to look just like one of those VHS tapes. Look at this. Look at this. That is a work of art. Death's Head Press, they're the ones who put it out. I mean, that is an absolute work of art. Even the back even has uh, the video store sticker here. It's a fake sticker. But... It looks just like a videotape. I don't know if I can hold them here side by side, but I mean, you know, here we are. We're in the video store. I mean, you know, look at this. So kudos to Death's Head Press on this production. I, I don't know who the artist is. I should have checked that beforehand. But they deserve to get a shout out. Let's see here. Uh, I'll find out. There's, there's Wes's signature. For Brian, can you resist? Enjoy old man. That's you know that's the kind of love that that my protege is giving me. Ah, here we go. Justin T. Coons is the cover artist. Uh, props to you, Justin. I I don't know if you also designed the book layout, but if you did, it's amazing. Uh, props to Death's Head Press for doing something daring and different like this. Um, this is how you tell readers, hey, we the publisher give a shit about the books we publish. It's how you tell your authors that. And congratulations to Wes. We've got a cover blurb by Wiley Young. We've got uh, a cover blurb by Mary San Giovanni. Cover blurb by Jonathan Jans. And yeah, this is amazing. On sale right now in paperback, also an ebook. But look, I, I don't judge you. If, if you prefer to read on your Kindle, by all means, read on your Kindle. But I think you can agree. This is a book that would look great on your shelf. Buy it in paperback if you can. Uh, it's available on Amazon right now. Again, that is Resisting Madness, Collected Short Fiction. The author is Wesley Southard. Uh, I'm a big fan of Wes's, you know, disclaimer, uh, I consider Wes one of my protégés, you know, I've been helping him for a few years now, 
Uh, yeah, I've been helping Wiley Young for a few years now, uh, you know, and uh, I'm real proud of these guys. Uh, I'm proud to see what they're doing, and my God, what a book. I'm jealous. I'm jealous. I want a book that looks like this. So anyway, that's it. Peace out.